Hello everyone, in this video I'm going to be doing a guide about Walt in Honkai Star Row in just a couple of minutes. Walt is an imaginary type character in Honkai Star Row that excels in both dealing damage and crowd controlling enemies. Walt's skills, his normal attack gravity suppression, Walt's normal attack is a single target attack that deals imaginary damage equal to a percentage of Walt's attack to a single enemy. His skill edge of the void, Walt's skill is a bounce attack that slashes 3 times, 1 dealing imaginary damage equal to a percentage of his attack to a single enemy, and then 2 extra times to a random enemy, on hit there's a 65% base chance to reduce the enemy speed by 10% for 2 turns. His ultimate synthetic black hole, Walt's ultimate is an AoE attack that deals imaginary damage equal to a percentage of his attack to all enemies. There's a 100 base chance for enemies hit by disability to be imprisoned. Imprisoned enemies have their actions delayed by 32% and speed reduced by 10% and entry costs 120. Walt's talent time distortion. His talent enhances his attack if the enemy hit is already slowed, he deals additional imaginary damage equal to a percentage of his attack to the enemy. Walt's technique gravitational imprisonment creates a small black cold zone that lasts for 15 seconds. Enemies that enter this area have their movement speed slowed by 50%. Upon entering the battle in the black hole zone, there's a 100% chance for the enemies to become imprisoned. Imprisoned enemies have their actions delayed by 20% and speed reduced by 10%. Walt's traces. His basic attack trace increases his ultimate damage by 25%. His skill trace judgment using his ultimate additionally regenerates 10 energy. His ultimate trace punishment deals 20% more damage to enemies inflicted with weakness break. For leveling, you want to focus on leveling his ultimate with his skill, then his talent, and then his basic attack. Light codes. His best 5 star light cone is in the name of the world because it increases his damage to debuff enemies, and when he uses his skill, his effect, hit rate, and attack are also increased. His best 4 star light cone is We Will Meet Again because it allows allows him to deal more additional damage to other enemies. For relics, his main 4 piece that you want to give him is Thief of Shooting Meteor. It increases his break effect by the 2 piece and 4 piece effect, and then regenerates 3 energy when he inflicts weakness break on an enemy. For main 2 piece that you want to give him Pain Galactic, it increases his effect hit rate by 10%, while his attack increases by an amount that is equal to 25% of his effect hit rate up to a maximum of 25%. Main stats. For body piece, you want to go for effect hit rate percentage. For feet, you want to get either speed to make him take more turns or break for his abilities. For spear, you want to get either attack percentage for the scaling from his abilities or imaginary damage boost if necessary. And for leak rope, you want energy regen so you can frequently utilize the crowd control capabilities from his ultimate. For substats, you want to focus on getting break, speed, attack percentage, and then crit stats. Malt Eldalon. If you are interested in his Eldalon, his first ones aren't really that great to get until his E4 because it increases his base chance for his skill to inflict speed reduction by 35% and his E6 isn't really worth getting. Walt is a character that can be a good sub damage dealer that can help sustain enemies in Hawkeye Star Row. Thank you for watching, if you enjoyed the video and found it helpful then subscribe to the channel for more content, leave a like to support the video, check out my Twitch to catch my live streams, and I hope you have a wonderful day. Peace.